Thanks, man. Here, how y'all doing? <laughs> I got a question to ask y'all. Y'all can, uh, <laughs> y'all can comment it, do a video response, whatever y'all want to do. But, uh, just out of curiosity and a little fun, unless you're scared your wife might see it. Uh, Who did you have a crush on growing up? Or who do you have a crush on now? As far as, uh, you know, people. Growing up, uh, my first crush was Barry Bertinelli. Well, she's the same age as me. Uh, I started watching her when she was on that show, uh, One Day at a Time, I believe was the name of it. Uh, I thought she was, she was hot back then. And, uh, she still looked pretty good, too. Uh, then, uh, another one would be Barbie Benton. Yeah, she was a uh, Playboy model back in the 70s, married to Hugh Hefner. Um, but she sings, and she's a good-looking woman. I thought she was always just the cutest thing. Y'all remember this? Came here on uh, my first video. But, uh, anyhow, um, I always thought she was cute. In fact, uh, there was an old girl that I went to school with, uh, we, uh, well, the first time Hank Williams Jr. came to Alec, well, Alexandria, Louisiana, y'all wouldn't know what Alec was, so, I mean, <laughs> locals, we call it Alec, but, um, first time he came to Alexandria to a Coliseum, uh, I was in 10th grade, I believe it was, and uh, I got up nerve, and I asked Lou Ellen if she could go to the concert with me. And uh, I always thought this girl looked looked a lot like Bobby Benton, the way she carried her hair and everything. But uh, Lou Ellen, she uh, she agreed to go with me. Ooh, I was like, all right. So, I took and uh, I, I always was kind of tight water to save every penny I made. And uh, I, uh, the tickets was going on sale on Tuesday or Wednesday and uh, I gave Dave the money and Dave went and uh, got the tickets for me. And uh, it was, uh, uh, if I remember correctly, the throw, third row, center stage, on the floor. Oh man, they were good tickets. I mean, we 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 were we was right there. Well, I took and saved my money and got uh, enough money. Took her out to eat a nice meal. Then we went to the concert. We having a good time, and uh, Hank Williams Jr. came on say, stage and started singing. Oh, it, it was nice. Well, about three or four songs into the concert, I'm gonna reach my hands over there and try to hold her hand. Well. She leaned over me. I'm like, oh man, I'm fixing to get some sugar here. And she said, um, I just want to be friends. 
may have ruined that concert for me. I was somewhat upset for a while. First thing I kept thinking is, I spent all this money on you, and you want to be friends, and that's it? Hmm. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't do keen on that. But, okay. Well enough, well enough, I just let it go. We, we remained friends through school and everything, and, uh, several years after we got out of school, I, uh, I bumped into her in a department store, and I, I asked her if she would date anybody, and she said no. I said, uh, well, would you like to go out? She said, yeah, I'd love to. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Tanker Man should have rode a short bus. You know? I think y'all right. But, anyhow. So I go out there and... I uh, picked her up. I took her to a nice restaurant. Uh, we went to watch a movie. And everything. Uh, oh, it was awesome. Well, I thought, halfway through the movie, I'm going to reach my hand over there, try to hold her. She leaned over again. I thought to myself, no, not again. Yep, sure enough, I just want to be friends. Now, <laughs> I can respect that. But here's the thought. My friends and me, we go somewhere, they pay their own way. I don't pay theirs. <laughs> so, I don't get that one. But, uh, yeah, a couple of y'all friends of mine on Facebook, y'all probably going through my friends list looking up Lou Ellen. Yeah, she's on there. So, y'all can go ahead and rag me now. But she, um, she was a sweet girl. But, uh, but just out of curiosity and for fun of it, I was wondering, uh, who was y'all's crushes? Uh, well, Hermit, he don't need, uh, reply to this because Hermit, he, um, on one of his videos, he done admitted that he has the hots for uh, Nancy Pelosi. So, um, Herman, you're excused for from uh, answering uh, any of these questions. Uh, you know, they say uh, beauty is in the eyes of beholder. So, uh, yeah. I guess Herman, if that's what you like, go for it. Shaking my gizzards. Oh yeah, if y'all want, just leave a comment or do a video response or whatever. Let me know who was y'all's uh, sweeter, sweetheart, crush, whatever you want to call it. Turn your hand out. Y'all stay safe.